How to get a green lawn. Make everyone in your neighborhood green with envy over your lush lawn with these landscaping secrets. You will need a soil test, fertilizer, water, and sharp lawnmower blades. Step one, test your soil to find out what nutrients it needs. Garden centers often sell do-it-yourself kits, or you can arrange a test through the Cooperative Extension System, a national agriculture network. Find a nearby extension office on the USDA website. Step two, don't put too much fertilizer out at one time. One pound of actual nitrogen per 1,000 square feet is a good rule of thumb, but follow the directions on your package. After fertilizing, lightly water your lawn to wash any excess off the blades and to help the fertilizer reach the roots. Step three, give your lawn about one inch of water per week. If it's really hot out, give it an inch of water every three to five days. A can set outside will tell you how much rainwater your lawn has gotten. Time how long it takes for the can to fill up one inch. Many extension websites have guidelines on the optimum water amounts for different types of grass. Step four, water your grass early in the morning so the blades dry before sundown. Otherwise, fungus may develop. Step five, mow your grass weekly from spring through fall. Check your lawnmower blades for sharpness. Dull ones weaken the grass by tearing it. Grass mowed with sharp blades will look like it's been cut straight across with scissors, while dull blades leave jagged edges. If your lawn has a white cast after mowing, your lawnmower needs sharpening. Step six, make sure the grass is dry but not arid when you are ready to mow it. To test, stick a screwdriver into the ground. If it goes in up to the handle without much force, it's fine. Step seven, leave the grass two to three inches high depending on the variety. This shades the grass, which helps the roots hold moisture. It also prevents weeds from growing. Step eight, mow in a different direction every couple of weeks to keep the grass healthy. Step nine, leave the clippings on your lawn. They're a good source of fertilizer. Step 10, don't let autumn leaves linger on your lawn or they'll weaken grass by blocking sunlight. Did you know, human hair has been found to be an effective plant fertilizer.